Who is Anthony Joshua? Joshua is a two-time unified world heavyweight champion and an Olympic gold medalist with one of the strongest resumes in all of boxing. He defeated heavyweights all the way from Dylan White, Joseph Parker, Alexander Povetkin, Kubra Tuyev, Andy Ruiz Jr. and even Vladimir Klitschko. Anthony Joshua was born on 15 October 1989 and as a kid he excelled at football and athletics. He began boxing when he was 18 and when offered $50,000 to turn pro, he refused them because in his own words he said that he didn't want money, but wanted to win medals. And that is what he did. In 2011, Anthony Joshua won a silver medal in the European Championship. Then the following year in 2012, Joshua won a very controversial fight and won the Olympics gold medal. One year after winning gold, Joshua set his sights to dominate professional boxing. In just two years, Joshua won 10 professional fights in heavyweight boxing by knockout. The following year, Joshua won 5 more fights and faced top heavyweight prospect Dylan White. Another knockout to finish. Within 7 rounds, Anthony Joshua dominated and knocked out Dylan White, securing his WBC and Commonwealth title. In April 29, 2017, Joshua took on one of boxing's greatest heavyweights, Vladimir Klitschko, who holds the largest combined, the longest combined world heavyweight championship reign in history. Klitschko was the heavyweight champion for 4,382 days for 12 years in a row, way longer than any fighter in history. During this fight, both Klitschko and Joshua got knocked down by each other's punches. But in the 11th round, Joshua was finally able to overwhelm 41-year-old Klitschko and defeated him by technical knock. After Klitschko, Joshua defeated another top contender in, heavyweight, in the heavyweight division, Joseph Parker, who is known to be a very dangerous striker. Joshua won by unanimous decision by dodging Parker's striking abilities and outpointed his way to a great victory. After Parker, Russian knockout artist Alexander Povetkin challenged Joshua for a title fight. Joshua never refuses dangerous fights and thus fought Povetkin. During this interesting battle, Joshua overwhelmed Povetkin and Povetkin was forced to go back. Povetkin lost to Joshua's devastating power and got knocked down twice in the seventh round. After Povetkin, Joshua chose to fight Andy Ruiz Jr., another heavyweight knockout artist who was very fast for his size and weight. In their first fight, Anthony Joshua played to Ruiz's advantage and boxed him closely. While Joshua managed to knock down Ruiz, Ruiz kept fighting, counter-attacked and managed to knock down Joshua four times in their fight, making Joshua lose by TKO. But Joshua got wiser much faster, learning that his strength against Ruiz is to fight with his reach, since Ruiz is shorter. Joshua got a rematch versus Ruiz and defeated him by unanimous decision, becoming a two-time unified world heavyweight champion. After defeating Ruiz, high-ranked mandatory challenger Kubrat Pulev challenged Joshua to become unified champion. During this fight, AJ dominated and knocked down Pulev two times before knocking him out in the ninth round. A lot of boxing analysts said that this showed some weakness in Joshua since he could have finished the fight earlier, but did not. And now, the time is here! Anthony Joshua faced on Sunday Music in September 25 for one of the greatest heavyweight boxing fights of all time. Will the ex-undisputed, undefeated, cruiserweight king manage to defeat AJ, the undisputed unified heavyweight king? We will see in September 25. Anthony, how are you? Now box the like button if you enjoyed this video and tell me down below who do you think will win. Get ready for September 25, Anthony Joshua faces Yuzik. Anthony Joshua versus Yuzik. Who will win? Let's get ready.